Welcome back to All Stodacy. In the last episode, we continued through the experimental staff, and we're at the end of this area, so let's go ahead and head up there. There's going to be cutscenes, I'm up the volume here. Well, up ahead there will be. The glass chamber. by degrees? What? Don't listen to him, Seth. <sighs> you know madness ate away at him. <sighs> you have no choice but to kill him. <sighs> when your blade pierced his heart, it may have just as well pierced your own. No! I didn't kill him! <sighs> Give it thought. Shut it out of your mind. What about your orders, Lieutenant Argonaut? I'm no longer your pawn. The memory you erased has returned. Oh, really? That was clever. Realizing that even death couldn't compare to the pain of being unable to remember. I might as well have been dead these past 30 years serving as your agent. Those 30 years weren't so bad now, were they? I merely made the best use. Of your abilities. It was dirty work. <laughs> it suited you. There had to be a reason for us to come to this world in the first place. That includes you. What reason could that be? Ah, so your memories haven't completely returned. My power was indeed effective at that time, meager though it may have been. Hey, 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 come on now. You know, you just do way too much talking and not enough listening. You know? Silence, you idiot. Hey, I ain't shutting up. You're the worthless scum after what you did to my eyes. Oh, by the way, uh, that memory wiping poking you gave me? Well, see, I used it on someone else. I don't know if that's a problem or not. I know. I saw everything you saw, remember? <laughs> You're the sleazy one, Lord Eyebrows. Oh, and uh, before I forget, this is the gold you gave me. I really want to throw it back in your face. I'm just an idiot, right? Huh? Is that what you think? Huh? Can you see this, old man? Take a look at that! <laughs> see that? As if that matters to me. You lowly scum all deserve each other's company. What's that supposed to mean? Your newfound comrades. Kaim, Seth, Sarah, and Ming. They're traitors. Each and every one of them. Traitors? Traitors? We came here for a noble cause. Then you abused your immortality to try and take over. And I was forced to bring an end to your atrocities. If you think about it, I taught you all the lesson! Liar! You're the one who wanted control of this world! Seth, calm down! How pathetic. <sighs> Do you know why? I ordered you to Grand Staff, so that our mission would be a swift success. And what is that mission? That will not be revealed to traitors like you. Not traitors! <laughs> what do you think you can do about it? You will return our memories. I think not. <laughs> Cook, Mac, stay out of this. It's because of you, Mom's dead. I'm gonna stay by you. Sarah, these are your grand 
and children. I'll kill them as I killed your daughter. Well, that's evil thing to say. Anyway, the boss battle we're about to fight, uh, you cannot win it. So your goal is just to survive. Um, I don't know if you can flee or not, but if you can flee, then you can do that and just in the battle immediately. You just, you just literally can't win it. But I'll still probably put it in my boss's video anyway. This time, your memories will be permanently locked away, leaving you walking corpses for all time! We'll see which of us is the traitor. Just as you were regaining your memories, you return here only to lose them again? You're as stupid now as you were 30 years ago! Just what is magic energy? I won't be defeated by those who don't even understand its true nature. over all my power? You have all forgotten our real mission. Ah. <laughs> Immortal beings with no guidance put this world in jeopardy. Want this to end? Would you rather go back to being living corpses or witness the deaths of those you love? This room is. Ridiculous! There's no merit in the memories of treacherous worms like you! happened here, Gungora? Uh, uh, there is no cause for concern, Your Majesty. These are foiled assassins sent by people who bear you ill will. But... This is the Queen of Namara! Hmm. 
Surely your majesty is aware that Numara is preparing to attack Ura. But what would the queen be doing here? I'm not sure. But if I may ask, Your Excellency, did you come here just to see them? No! I came to tell you all the essential components have been loaded. Your Majesty had to deliver such a message personally? My apologies. My people should have done that. It's all right. I wanted to do it. I see. Well then, let us be off. And what of them? Leave them. It won't matter. But there are children. They are a threat to your majesty's life. We cannot allow such treachery, even from children. Now that you are king, you must make difficult decisions, your majesty. Yes. Yes, of course. staff will sink into the sea and dwell in silence and darkness for all time. It's Lyrum. Watching over her kids. Looks like we have our memories, too. Good. Ah, oh, wow. Thanks, kid. What? Oh. What? Ming! Thanks. Uh -oh. I'm all right. Brain freeze. Good. Oh, man. Oh. Uh oh, this is bad. Can you run? 
The amount of time left before the experimental staff crumbles is this plate in the upper left. Get out before the time runs out. Time will continue to elapse during enemy encounters, but it will be paused while the menu screen is displayed. When the timer reaches zero, the experimental staff will self-destruct, making it impossible to escape. Yep. There's nothing here in the glass chamber to get in terms of items. So don't worry about that. You want to try to get in as few random encounters as possible, obviously, because... Um, uh, the battles take a long time in this game to complete, so... Oh, the elevator is broken. Oh no, we can't go that way. Okay. I think they give you plenty of time, though. There's three items we can get on the way out, too. But make sure to hold square when you're going through here so we can complete it quicker. What? Clock sticking. <laughs> but now we have plenty of time. I ain't, I ain't even worried about it. leveling up all of a sudden. Weird. Okay, power drink. I remember this because I played this game a couple years ago, so <laughs> hasn't been that long ago. I remember panicking because I was scared I was going to miss something. But this, these are the only items you get. You get the power drink, and then you get this chest here with a red snake and a snake ring. Oops. The red snake to her to balance her out. And snake ring occasionally causes blind and poison. Okay.
That's all the items in the experimental staff. We got every single item. Oh, we got new enemy. Uh, explosive bug. Wow, she killed me in one hit. Damn. That's one way to get the job done. I wasn't expecting to kill him. Most of the time the battles are watching animations and stuff. So if you get to a lot of random encounters, it could be bad. But I'm doing them pretty qu as quickly as possible, so. Quick level up, level 30. Common magic defense boost and Sarah learn composite magic level 2. Still learning stuff. Get out. We got to go now. Get to the chapel. Every time I escape a place in a game I gotta reference that. Well it only took me three uh five minutes. Now completed disc two. We're on disc three now. Obviously, there's no disc though because I'm playing digitally, but still. Thirty hours to complete the first two disc. I did pretty much everything there is to do too, for the most part. Disc change complete. <laughs> Even though there was no disc change. Oh, she finally sank. Alas, we knew her well. I think we pushed it too far. But it still managed to get us all the way over to the port. We have one to the port thing. That's for sure. Welcome back. That was some lightning, wasn't it? Everyone was worried about you. 
So glad you're safe. Are the children alright? Yeah, I'm okay. Me too. Well, good. Don't endanger yourselves like that anymore. You made it through some bumpy waters. So don't you take it easy in town this evening. Thank you. We'd love to, right, Kaim? Yeah, sounds good. But this kind of puts us in a bind. Since we have lost the only ship left in town, guess we can forget about going to Goatsa anytime soon. I come to think of it, you were traveling to Goatsa, weren't you? Yes. Well, I have good news for you. The lightning melted the glacier blocking the road to Goatsa. You'll start to get through the ice canyon, but at least you can reach Goatsa on foot now. Great. That means we can get to Goatsa even faster. How lucky is that? For a while there, I thought we'd be stuck here. Yeah, our journey can't end just yet. But we probably shouldn't push ourselves any further today. Let's go back to town and rest. Lighting mud part of the wall in the ice canyon, they say. Ice Canyon Road to Goatsa City is passable nowadays, isn't it? Ice is mudded after all. Well done. Monsters are gone and that annoying mist has finally been lifted. This wouldn't have happened without you guys. Thank you so much. Where's my reward? Oh, thank heavens. You're all here. You were on your way to Goatsa City, weren't you? Well... A bolt of lightning just opened up a path for you guys. I'm so glad you were safe. The water was so treacherous. I thought maybe I was just worried. Well, I'm glad you're, you were safe. The water was so treacherous. I thought maybe I was just worried. Oh, same thing. Oops. Heard that twice. Light's gone from the western sea. I saw it myself and now all the weird stuff's gone from town. Well, that's good. Town's back to normal. <laughs> you aren't hurt, are you? You should probably get a good rest at the inn while you can. Well, Kaim's immortal, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, we can now go in here now. I'm pretty sure. Oh, Travers, would you like to have one of the special rings I make? Okay, we can now make level 2 rings. But we have to make all the other ones first. Yeah, we already have that. So this guy doesn't have anything new. It's all the same stuff. You're doing beast eyes. Regenera. Give one party member moderate gradual HP recovery. Bind healer. Pretty sure this is the auction house. The rest stuff is getting tough to find these days, but hey, have a look around. Someone's auctions are actually quite famous among those in the know. 
You get to see some very interesting things if you stay here long enough. Merchants come from all around the world to see what they fucking find. You'll see a lot of strange and unusual items on the auction house. Even if you have come from far away, you'll still get your money's worth here. Aren't these clothes just darling? They're from a land far to the south. They told me they got these clothes from across the ocean, but they're just a little thin for our cold climate. climate. Sir, but could you come back later? We're kind of out of stuff to sell right now. Yeah, the auction house isn't open until this 4. Water beast ring. I'll try to make this alchemist ring, trimmer ring. Do I have that? Reading beast eye. There's like so many rings in this game. If I can't make the alchemist ring. I don't have the necessary items to do it. Town is back to normal now. Ooh, what's up? I think just kind of tired. Me too. I can't blame them. They've been through a lot. Let's get some rest today. Obviously, Gangora robbed us of our memories. He's the traitor. But we still don't remember what our mission was in coming to this world. Sarah, was there anything about this in your journals? No, not about our mission. There was something about where we came from, however. We came from a pure, untarnished world. Two different worlds on a shared axis converged, which caused disturbances in our homeworld. Our minds came to this world where we acquired bodies and began what we call living. During that time, I wondered constantly what the meaning of that existence was and why we were seemingly immortal on this world. I began researching to find some answers. I just want the facts. Facts? If the record of a thousand years shows that I am really a traitor, then I'll have to accept that and pay the price. If the truth is that I've caused the deaths I've seen, then I'll have to pay the price. That can't be true! As long as our memories aren't complete, Gangora holds the upper hand. We've got to go after him. So that's why we're going to Goza. Oh, and why Ming's gonna use her charm when we get there. Like it. Kaim, the only thing we can do is seek the truth. Fortunately, we have plenty of time. Got some support from the King of Goats, so we would be able to head to for Ura right away. Let's get my memory back. Making a face like that is going to give you more wrinkles, you know. 
Goro, I swear I won't let him get away with this. Said in Anera, we were best friends. No, we were a family. Those children must really be exhausted. They're sleeping like babies. Mission, what was it? Can you call anything kind? Obviously not. Ah, oh, mom. Yep, expand the group. Yes, okay, I guess we'll go get some rest then. Yeah, while well, Kaim and Sarah do do some things. Hopefully, they kick oh, uh, Cook and Max got to go to Cook and Matt got to go too. All right, but I'm in the video here. In the next episode, we'll talk to the people around here. See what they have to say after everything's back to normal. Later.